And we're back, Stephanie Cameron, live at the Las Vegas Money Show. I love Vegas. You love Vegas? I love Vegas. Vegas, Vegas is a great place. Vegas is the best. How come you guys are not here? This is a Come great join show. us next time. This is great. I'm here with uh, Keith Fitzgerald, Chief Investment Strategist. And um, let's talk about the future. Okay. Because the future is exciting. It's dynamic. It's, it's a little compelling. scary. Yeah, it's scary. Yeah, yeah, Can yeah. your job be replaced by artificial intelligence? My job, probably not. Pure yeah. intelligence, yeah. yeah. My wife says that all the time. But, but here's the thing, you know, we fear technology, but mm -hmm. history shows, if you look at the record industry, you look at the CD right. industry, you look at music, you look at cars, technology, it. if you embrace it, can right. be harnessed. And not only that, from an investment perspective, it can create huge amounts of wealth. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, look at so, Amazon, look at Apple, yeah. look at Microsoft. These are some of the big names. People say, oh my God, what if I could buy that? Well, the answer is you can. Yes. People say, aren't they expensive now? Well, they said that five years ago, 10 years ago, 20 years ago, and yet those people have made millions of dollars by buying companies that are must-haves, that are changing the world, right. involved in every facet of our lives. Or you could buy an ETF. You could buy an ETF. Like bots. Yes, there's right? some great Robo, there. Absolutely, right? Robo, yeah. I mean, so you're not in just that one company, because that's everybody's fear. Well, right. You get into one company and it doesn't move, but every other company does. Right, now, there right. is a way to buy one company mm -hmm. and still have that perspective. Okay. But you gotta go bigger. That's when okay. you're starting to talk about the Apples, the Amazons, the Alphabets, right. because these are companies, for example, there's is what? Apple is involved in the iPad, the phone. They think it's a device company. It's not a device company. It hasn't been a device company for 20 years. Mm -hmm. Apple's the ecosphere. This is why they're making a move into a trillion dollar medical devices business. Okay. Now, if you think Apple's expensive now, right. imagine what happens. It's really not. Warren Buffett's buying yeah. it. Warren Buffett is buying right. that. That should tell you That's something. That's huge. Here's why. That is huge. Imagine what happens. Right. When Apple is successfully classified via the FDA as a medical device company and your doctor prescribes you an Apple. He says, oh, mm. Stephanie, you really need the watch and you need the iPad. Now, all of a sudden, the insurance companies are paying for it. They think the $1,000 cell phone is irrelevant. You've got 15, 20, 30 billion dollars on the table in the health industry crying for change. Right. And Apple's right there to provide something mm. that nobody's even thinking about. So they're monitoring you? Yeah, they're, they're heart, blood sugar, wow. activity, yeah, information awesome. that, by the way, can go um, straight to your doctor's office. Right. Now, there is a scary side in the interest of full mm, disclosure. That's true. You eat that extra donut in the morning, and guess what happens to your insurance uh, premiums in the you. afternoon? They're watching everything. That's the world we live in. <laughs> but as an investor, you know what? Mm. There's a huge amount of money on the That's table, uh, and I'm very excited by companies like that because they're right. doing things that are literally changing the world it we is. live in. Artificial intelligence is another one. Yeah, it's huge. Huge. Monster market, but it's yeah. not just Which about the machines. Which country do you think is going to lead it? That's, That's a tough call because, you know, in the, in the past I would have said it's America. But have if you, you look at a company Sophia? like Alibaba. Have you seen Sophia, yeah. the robot? Yes, I have seen Sophia. She's a citizen. So accurate okay. that she's a, robot. she's a citizen. Yes, that's right. So that brings into question. Saudi Arabia. Yeah, I know it. That's, that's a little freaky. Yeah, but again, <laughs> if you look at the that's premise like, from an investment standpoint, the question is not, do I like this or do I not like this? Am uh -huh. I going to have a job? Am I going to have this? It's two of my favorite words. Well, three actually. Imminent. Inevitable, right, and profitable, right. Yeah. Because these companies wouldn't exist exactly if they weren't valuable. Yeah. Of and so course. the question is, of how course. do you deal with it? And I think that's very exciting. It. You have to embrace it, and and we have to profit off of it, right? We live in a fascinating and potentially yeah. extraordinarily prosperous time. Yeah. And you know, it takes guts, it takes courage, because there's a lot of noise. There's politics. There's headlines. There's bitter stuff going on right. with the social media. I mean, it's become a blood sport to offend people, and I, you know that's wrong. So how can people find you? Because we're running out of time. We're how running out of time. Yes. How ah. can they follow you and be one of well, your subscribers? Well, they can be in Vegas, right? Uh, and okay. see me. Uh, that's always you know, a good thing. You can be in Vegas. Me. I'll, I'll but be here. Thank you for asking. You yeah. can go to totalwealthresearch.com, okay. where you will find all of my missives. Uh, you'll find all of my media appearances, lots of things, but most importantly, right. hopefully, you'll find some profitable, actionable information. Yeah, that's awesome, guys. It's been yeah. so much fun. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Yeah, Thanks for having excellent. me. Thank Let's you for again. paying attention.